Hi, this is Andrew Sheaf with Mastering Flow. I help triathletes identify the critical skills for fast swimming, and I provide them with the tools to learn those skills in any location. For a free eight-week technical training program to help you get your skills on track, click on the link in the video description below. We're working on how to combine the different steps of the optimizing your breathing process to accelerate your progress. Triathletes are often challenged by the need to breathe rhythmically, and this can offset their breathing technique. By combining bobbing and paddle cap freestyle, you can learn how to breathe rhythmically and then take that skill directly into paddle cap freestyle where you really try to retain that rhythmic breathing as well. If your ability to breathe rhythmically and patiently is impairing your ability to execute paddle cap freestyle correctly, this is a combination that will work well for you. Feel free to include any type of bob that you find to be effective. Watch the videos that follow for a reminder of the exercises, and then check out the sample sets that follow to see how to put it into action. For access to digital copies of all the sample sets I've created for this series and others, click on the link in the video description below where you'll get free and immediate access. Paddle Cap Freestyle is a wonderful way to solve many problems at the same time. By requiring swimmers to keep the paddle on their cap, they must keep their head relatively stable throughout the whole stroke especially the breath. This will help to correct problems with wiggling through the water. Most importantly, the paddle provides concrete feedback about how well swimmers are performing the exercise. As they become more comfortable swimming with the paddle on their head, they can begin to perform the exercise at higher speeds and higher effort levels. Deep bobbing is the most valuable bobbing tool and it's what we've been working towards. You'll want to really focus on keeping a great rhythm using the bottom of the pool as little as possible. Control your breathing and pay attention to how you slow down as you drop in the water and how you speed up as you rise to the surface. That's the lungs doing their work. The more you can get comfortable bobbing in deeper water, the more comfortable you'll be with your breathing and your overall sense of safety in the water. 